you guys on smoking, huh? All right, class, settle down, settle down, settle down, class. All right, class, today we're gonna be learning about our shapes. Everyone know their shapes, right? Triangle and circle and stuff like that. Everyone knows that Mr. Jimenez is a square. Come on, teach. Yeah, you know I like to fool with you. I'm that type of cool teacher. Anyway, guys, today we have a huge announcement. Uh, it's a new rule change at school. It is no drinks allowed in the classroom because there's some bad eggs that sneak alcohol into the classroom. They sneak it into water bottles and they sneak it into juice bottles. So you're not allowed to have drinks in the classroom. So if I catch you drinking a drink, I have to take it away because it might be alcohol. So like I said, no drinks allowed in the classroom because a lot of students have been sneaking in alcohol into the classroom. Mr. Jimenez, did you not just hear me? What is that? It's just water. Just water? More like vodka. What, what, what Fiji? Yeah. What type of water is this? I mean, it's water. It's just really good water. Do they drink alcohol in Fiji? Um, I don't know. Most likely. Maybe. Let me, let me try this. <clears throat> it's a pretty good water. Then why you spit it out? Because you're not supposed to be drinking it. And it might be alcohol. Even though it's not. Still have to take this away. Because it could be alcohol. And no drinks allowed. You just take that's what the, the board says, no drinks allowed. So I am going to have to take this. Like I was saying, class, <clears throat> no drinks allowed because people sneak alcohol. Mr. 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 what is that? It's just apple juice. I said no drink apple juice. More like Hennessy. What, what, what is that, Minute Maid? Like maids? Yeah, no, no, no. It's just a company. It's just a company. Mm, doesn't look like apple juice to me. Looks like I have to try it. Oh god, that's pretty good apple juice. But I have to take this too, because that could be alcohol. Why'd you keep spitting it out? Because I gotta make sure it's not alcohol. And I, what, it doesn't matter. Look, no drinks allowed. It's all because of bad eggs that bring in alcohol in their bottles. I said no drinks allowed. So, no drinks allowed. I gotta have to take this from you. Alright class, so like I was saying, no drinks allowed. Now let's get on to our shape. So everyone, what is this one? <laughs> what is that? What is that? Cranberry grape. Cranberry grape? It's really good. More like drinking and date night rape. That's what I'm saying right there. If she can't give consent, it's not, what is that? Cranberry grape. Yeah. Who drinks that? Me, it tastes really good. Oh, that's so dark. That could be any type of alcoholic drink. That could be wine. That could be, that could be so many different things. You know what I'm about to do now, right? What? Try it. Oh, Why'd like, you do that? That one's bad. <laughs> that one's pretty bad. Why, okay, this might not be alcohol. It could be, because there's so many berries, and this wine that tastes like this, it tastes like what you drink during New Year's. This one's questionable. I'm sending this one to the principal. <laughs> This one, this one's going on the questionable list because that could be alcohol. So anyway, no more drinks. Mr. Hemmenes! <laughs> God damn it! What do we have here? No, it's just, it's just fruit punch. Fruit punch! The only punch you're going to get is that one. What could this be? Open that up. It's not even open. You know what I'm going to have to do, right? <laughs> <laughs> Open it and give it to me. Oh. Open that goddamn fruit punch. Cause I gotta see if it's alcohol. Yeah, you're crying because you know it's alcohol, right? That that could be so many no. things. That looks like red wine to me. Oh no, no, please. Hold on, let me. No, please. Mm. No. Mm. Oh. no! <laughs> oh, okay, that one. Got in my mouth. That's pretty good. That's definitely not, oh, that's definitely, I'm sorry on that one. This is fruit punch. Duh! That's fruit punch. And I'm not bad for that one. I'm, I'm putting that in my favorites. That's, that's my favorite one. I'm going to keep that one, all right? So, no more drinks, right? No more drinks. None. So, no drinks allowed in class. No drinks allowed. Let me drop my chalk. All right, class, so that's a circle. That's a triangle. At the square, like Mr. Hemmenes! <laughs> Mr. Hemmenes! What is that? What is that? Lemonade! 
lemonade? Okay. Okay. Doesn't look like lemonade to me. It's yellow. It's yellow. Yeah. It's, oh. That looks like some diluted lemonade right there. That there's some other substance in that. Lemonade, that, no, that's not lemonade. It is. No, okay. I just tasted it. Oh, okay. Well, guess who's tasting it next? <laughs> Me. Can you miss somebody else? Oh. Mm. <laughs> that one, this is lemonade. You are, you've been correct of the last two. So, that's lemonade if I've ever tasted it. But, look, rules are rules. It took one bad egg to start all this. And I, yeah, I know you're not sneaking alcohol in these bottles. I mean, except for that one over there. That 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 one's getting tested. No, it's cranberry. Yeah. So no drinks allowed, Mr. Jimenez. I'm gonna say it one last time. No drinks allowed. And learn how to drink. Your, your shirt's all covered and you're spilling it. That wasn't even me. Yeah. That's I like that too. Oh well, look at all the drinks from all the students that keep bringing in. Could be alcohol. Anyway, class, circle, triangle, square, oval, hexagon, hexagon. All the drinks in the classroom should be gone. What the fuck is that? That's alcohol. Now that's alcohol. It's just water. I don't know that. That is alcohol if I've ever seen it. That is a wine bottle. You're so expelled. What is that? What is that? You said this is water? Yes. This is not water. It is. Oh, okay. Let me try. <laughs> That's tap water. I, I know. You took away my Fiji water. Why the hell do you have tap water inside of a wine bottle? To recycle and it holds more. So you're telling me that you put water in a wine bottle so you could, so you could recycle? Yes. I don't want to use water bottles. It's bad for the environment. Glass is better. So you're telling me you, you take bottles of water and you pour it into glass so you don't have to destroy the environment using plastic. Exactly. I'm thinking about the future. All right, class. I think we all can learn from Mr. Jimenez. He actually did something for the environment. He, instead of using all these fucking plastic bottles. <laughs> instead of using plastic, he's now using glass. And at the end of the day, that's what all this is about. Is that... Use glass bottles instead of plastic. Because you can wash this and use it over and over and over. And when you use plastic, it just goes in a landfill somewhere. So class, actually a round of applause for Mr. Jimenez. Yeah, all right. Well, I still have to take this because it could be alcohol. You, but... You just tasted it. Anyway, class. Class is dismissed. No drinks allowed. And I got a lot of drinks to go test to see if it's alcohol. Tito, how was that? Okay, I was not expecting the spitting on me. Um, yeah, there were some times where I just... I'm pretty sure this shirt stained. Is that your favorite shirt? It was. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. So, this was another classroom skit that was based on a true story. Let me explain the true... Let me explain the true story part. Um, a little bit is exaggerated. Just only a little bit. <laughs> uh, a little bit? Yeah. All right, guys. So, this is exactly what happened. So, I was in middle school... I was in uh, eighth grade. That's why I'm burping from having all those drinks. That's a lot of flavors. It really is. Yeah. So uh, I was in eighth grade. I was in middle school. And there was an epidemic of kids bringing alcohol in Minute Maid bottles. Like they were bringing it in Powerade. And basically kids were just bringing alcohol to school in water bottles and all this other stuff. So the school banned you to have drinks in your backpack. You were not allowed to bring drinks in your backpack. You were not allowed to drink in class because... You, it could be alcohol, and basically, basically only the like really like popular kids were doing it, right? So, uh, I every every day at lunch, I would go and I would buy this exact drink. I would buy this dark colored, very berry tasting. It was this one. I would buy this Minute Maid uh, at the lunchroom. Now it has a very very strong wine smell. And honestly, it kind of tastes like wine a little bit. Um, so I'd buy these at lunch every single day. So that, you know, if, throughout the day, if I got thirsty, I could just go in my backpack, just pull it out, you know, take a sip. Everything was good. Well, at the time, a lot of kids were getting caught with alcohol, you know, trying to sneak it into the, into the school. So it was my seventh period class. I was in the back of the classroom. 
And I, uh, my teacher was teaching, and I snuck it out, and I drank some, and the teacher turned around and saw me, and was like, Mr. 30 Acre, what is that? And I said, oh, it's, it's, it's just Minute Maid. And he was all like, no, bring it up, bring it up now. And the whole, okay, now keep in mind, I'm a nerdy kid in school, right? I solve a Rubik's Cube for fun. No one talks to me. I, I have a rolling backpack in eighth grade. No one really talked to me. I'm just, I'm quiet. I don't talk to anyone. So everyone was like, oh my God, 30 Acre brought alcohol. 30 Acre got caught. Oh my God. Oh my God. He, oh, what? We didn't see this coming. It's always the quiet ones. So <laughs> I go up to the teacher and I'm like, here. And he grabs it and he takes the top off and he goes, what the fuck? What, what is this? And I said, it's, it's Minute Maid, uh, it's Minute Maid Cranberry. He's like, no, that smells like alcohol. So he gets another teacher to come in the classroom and get that teacher to smell it. And they're like, what, what, what is this? So they, like, they go back and forth for like 30 minutes trying to find out if it's alcohol. And I don't know how they came to the conclusion that it wasn't, but it, I, I was off, on, I, I got off on it, you know. I, they, uh, they let me go because it wasn't alcohol, because I'm not stupid, I'm not, I'm not dumb, you don't, I don't do that. So yeah, so I was like, all right, well, I made this whole skit based on that because I was some little weird geeky kid um, who played, who saw Rubik's Cubes and they, they thought that I was sneaking alcohol in a uh, Minute Maid bottle. So this skit's a little bit over-exaggerated. A little bit? Only a little bit. I mean, the teacher did not spit in my face. Um, I only had one bottle, not 12 or how many we just went through. <laughs> um, yeah, so... That is the story of this video. So guys, if you like these school skits, let us know because it's really fun. These are, these are all based off of a true experience, I guess. Event? You know, a true event. Yeah, based on true events. Yeah. Um, but yeah, tell us if you guys liked it and we will do more because I have probably a million school experience stories. Yeah. Oh no, I got a lot. I got a lot. This, is, this one was pretty funny. I'm playing as you. Yeah, you're playing as me. I'm playing the teacher. Yeah. Nope. I want to be the teacher. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so real quick, Theo. Out of all the ones we tried, which one was your favorite? The water. The water? Yeah. Nah. The water. My favorite had to have been... Oh my god. My, my favorite was definitely this fruit punch. Oh my god. You know what? Mmm. That's... That's some good fruit punch. Theo, now technically, we drink after each other. Well, I drink after you. <laughs> What have you been doing with that dirty mouth? Some nasty stuff. <laughs> mm -hmm. So should I be worried? You don't want to know. So should I be worried that I drink after you? You should go to the doctor. <laughs> I need to get tested? Yes. <laughs> yes. You're going to have some really bad news. Really? Yes. Oh, no. So you've done some nasty stuff with that mouth? Nasty! Like, illegal? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, guys. So, what is... What is your guys's, what, what is you guys' favorite Minute Maid or, or juice or drink or, or what is your favorite drink, thing to drink? What's your favorite thing to drink? Yeah, there you go because it could be cold or something. Mine right now is lemonade. I like lemonade. I drink lemonade every day. I have not had soda in almost two years. I know. Drink soda. I don't want to. to. I don't want to drink. Oh, I, I was one of the Patriots from the Super Bowl supposed to drink soda. Anyway, guys, what's your favorite drink? Um, Tito's is water. Mm -hmm. Mine's lemonade. What is yours? I know Chili's is Pepsi. So, um, no, no, like water from there. We're talking about that, right? No, we're talking about favorite drink of all time. Oh, milk. Oh, come on, milk. Man. What? How am I? How did I forget? I was like, I was like, I, I thought we were talking about that. No, uh, yeah. I, I, wow. Tito's favorite drink is milk. Mine's lemonade. Chili's is Pepsi. And guys, do not try to take alcohol to school because that's stupid and it's illegal. And they, honestly, why not just drink Minute Maid? You know, not sponsored at all. We're not. I wish we were though. <laughs> Please sponsor me. Please sponsor me, man. <laughs> yeah, so don't, guys, don't do bad things. Don't, just, just, just go to sleep. Just play games. It would solve Rubik's Cubes. Don't have, go outside. Have a rolling backpack. Outside bed. <laughs> all right, guys. We're going to end this vlog. Oh, man, Teeds, look at that. Look at me.